Now we've done these live prank calls on our relaunch show, and it brought in. Yeah, it didn't last time. When, when I done the relaunch, it was uh, absolutely amazing. Loads of people tuned in. It was so funny. Right here we go. Right, let's uh, let's load up the number, guys. Might help if I unlock our phone. That might be a good start. That may help. That may, that, that may, <laughs> that may help. That may help indeed. Right. Okay. Let's bring up the dialing tone. Right. What's the number? Got it? One four one. Seven four two. I'm gonna get all mumbled to the back. Yeah, yeah, mumbling away to myself, guys. Here we go. McDonald's. Yeah, hello. Is that Max uh, McDonald's in Maidstone? Yeah, but this is the one on the M20, the services. Yeah, that that's fine. I was wondering if you can help me. Um, I was wondering, I've never had McDonald's before, and I was wondering if you could tell me what sort of um, main meals you offer on your menu. Yeah, it's, um, well, we have beef and chicken. So on the beef side, we have um, just Big Macs and M at the moment, and so, quarter pounders. So is... Is, what was that? A quarter pounder? S- uh, sorry, I can't hear very yeah, well. Yeah, it's a quarter pounder, the Big Mac, and an M. You can get those meals. Right, so it's a quarter pounder, a big cow, and a pig. No. No, sorry, sorry. Uh, um, so can you ap- I apologise? Can you, can you say that again, please? The Big Mac, a quarter pounder, and an M. Right, okay. Can you tell me what's in the Big Mac, please? I could, but I think you're taking, I think you're making a joke. Uh, n- no, so, sorry, I've never had McDonald's before, sir, that, that's all, I, d- I don't know what's in a Big Mac. Just the burger with lettuce, Big Mac sauce, onion, pickles and cheese. Right, so, so that there's cheese in it? Yeah. Uh, and what else was in it again, sorry? Big Mac sauce, lettuce, onion. Right, and what's in the Big Mac sauce, is that like homemade or something? Yeah, it's just a special one. A special sauce. Um, but when you say special, I don't understand what you mean by special sauce. Why is it called special? What's special about it? Bye-bye. Uh, s- sir, sir, sir. He's, hu- <laughs> He's hung up on us, guys. I'm really sorry. So that that was the first one. That was the McDonald's prank at a Maidstone. Right, I'm going to pass you over to Grace now. That was absolutely hilarious. You're winding me up. You're winding, you up. You're winding me up. Right, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> It was just the way you said it. It was like, you're having a joke with me. I was like, no, no, we're not. Please, stay on here. Stay on here. Oh, right, here we go. Another, another prank for you, listeners. Right. right what are we going for now? Where's our next victim? Let's go, let's go, let's have a look. We've got a long list here, if you're wondering what I'm doing right now. Yeah. We're just seeing who, who we can get for our next prank. Mm. Who's our next victim tonight? Do you know what? I think we're going to go for a kebab shop next. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Right, here we go. Right, okay. <laughs> show me how to use this office phone. I don't know how to use the office phone. Studio, right. you... We're not an office, we're a studio. Right. Okie dokie. Right, bring up the dialing tone and dial the number. Right, which one is it? This one? Yes, that one. Right. That one, DJ Ty. <laughs> <laughs> that one, DJ Ty. DJ Grace. <laughs> right, seven seconds. Hi there, um, I just wanted to ask a couple of questions about your menu. Sorry? I just wanted to ask a couple of questions about your menu. About our menu? Yes, uh, what, what is actually in a kebab? Say again? What is in an actual kebab? What's, uh, what's the name of the kebab? No, what is in a kebab? Kebab, we got donut, we got uh, fish, we got chicken. Okay, and what is in a donut kebab? Sorry? What is in a donut kebab? Donut kebab is in a pita bread. Lamb. No, no, what is donut kebab? What, what, we don't know what's mean the donut kebab. Yeah, what is in it? It's just meat, uh, lamb, lamb meat on the stick. Sorry, can you say that again? Sorry? Sorry, can you say it again? It's donut kebab. One more time. Didn't hear it this time. Donut kebab is lamb donut in the, sk- in the sheet, on the sk- 
Austria cooking as he don't see it's kebab. What do I get with that? Sorry? What do I get with that? It depends. If you want salad sauce, you can get it. Sorry, say again? It depends what you want. If you want a plain donut, you can get plain donut. If you want a pita bread, you can get pita bread. If you want a salad, you can get salad. If you want a sauce, you can get sauce with that. Oh. It depends what you what we. What sauces like. can I get? Sorry. What sauces? Darling, you're gonna play with us, you know. No, 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 no. Sorry, it's just because I've never had a kebab before. That, that's with all the questioning. Okay, it's no problem. But now I have no time to explain to you how you. Eat you haven't got time to take my order. Sorry. You haven't got time to take my order. Yeah, I have got time to take your order, but it's your order. Where are you calling from? Where am I calling from? Yeah. Where are you calling from? Are you taking the piece? Me? No. Yeah, you do. Me do? No do. <laughs> if you want to order, just give me your postcode and house number and we can go through the order. Hello? Hello, yeah, yeah, sorry about my sister, sir. Um, yeah, she, 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 she's never had a kebab before. Okay, can I have your postcode, please, sir? Uh, yep, it's um, C for Charlie, T for Tango, 8. Say again, please. Right, it's it's C for cat as in meow. Taking the piss, mate. Sorry. No, no, no. Me, me not take the piss. Me don't do that. <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey, woo, 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 woo. Yeah, right. That, uh, that was pretty good. That was a well long one. That was what you thought of that one. Yeah, that that was really good, guys. I actually really enjoyed that one. Well, we actually kept them going for quite a while, didn't we? We don't. You 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 take the piss. No, no, no. We don't take the piss. <laughs> uh, you're tuned in to Diverse FM 102.8. It is seven minutes past eleven. Thank you for tuning in with us. We're going to play you another song while we get the next prank ready. Hope you're enjoying what we're doing tonight, guys. Here is a little bit of nightcore for you. We're right here waiting for you. Day after day, and I slowly go insane. I hear your voice on the line, but it doesn't stop the pain. If I see you next to never, how can we say forever?
something. I know this station. I'm wide awake. It's Diverse FM. Diverse FM. On Spreaker.com. Hi guys, we're back. This is DJ Ty and you're tuned in to the Prank Call Show. Doing live prank calls with myself, DJ Ty and my special guest this evening, Grace. We've already done a couple this evening which have actually been quite hilarious. We was hoping to drag them on a little bit longer but I think they thought we were taking the mic a little bit. (laughs) Well, the only thing is with the prank is it can only go for so long as the person goes on for. But they went quite long actually. You can't help but, like, sniggle when they go, are you taking the piss? Are you taking the piss? It's like, no, no, <laughs> no. You know? Well, anyway, you told us what you think of those two pranks that we did, and we'll do a couple of more later on in the show. And it's nice to know um, any pranks that you've pulled on people or some nasty pranks that got pulled on you. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, do come into the Diverse FM chat room, guys, and let us know pranks that you had done to you or funny pranks you have done to other people. We've got the chat box closed. We do have a message. Should we open it up and see what our listeners are saying tonight? Oh, we, we get a smiley face off DJ Kevin. That's all we get. <laughs> well, I thought that was going to be a prank then, but it wasn't. It was a uh, laughing my butt off, DJ Kevin said. So you, so you like them pranks, did you, matey? That, that's just two of what we got lined up for you tonight. They are good. They are good. Hopefully they'll get better over time. I, I really hope they do. Uh, they sure should do because last time we done this, this was quite funny, wasn't it? Yeah. Right. Okay. Now. This is what we do in our spare. T- this is what we do in our spare time. Just wind people up. We do like to wind people up. It's fun. It's so much fun. It is actually really good fun. Right, guys. Um, we need you guys to interact with us because we find that the show runs a little bit better and a lot more fun when our listeners bounce off with us so if you come into the chat room guys and you know you basically give us some ideas for some live prank calls and work with us we'll work with you and we can create a really fun show for you here on diverse fm 102.8 because if we have fun then you have fun too that is very true yeah that is very true <laughs> that is the way it works i i do find that how's how's the audio sounding tonight guys i hope it's like loud and clear out there and you can understand us yeah, get, get, let us know in the Diverse FM chat room if uh, our audio is not so good tonight. But we have tried our best to uh, have the audio all up and running for tonight. So hopefully you could hear the live prank phone calls as well. Well, you obviously can because they were laughing. <laughs> Clear as a bell. <laughs> like a neck on a donkey. <laughs> what the, what's a neck on a donkey? I've never heard of that one before. What, what that H- haven't you heard the um, advert by... Oh, Nando's, Nando's. He says, I said, as long as our tools are ringing like the neck of a donkey. No, I've never heard of that one. But have you heard that new one from, oh, what's it called? Um, Amigos. You know, they got the loan, the loan advert. And when they go, if, um, oh, was it? If your friend thinks you can pay it back, all you need is a good amigo. Amigo. Yeah, that, that, that advert. <laughs> Isn't it? It's hilarious. I love that one. When I first saw it, I thought, the heck is this advertising? <laughs> The, the, the funniest advert is that read.co.uk. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you should be my wife. Call me. What was it? You hate Mondays because you hate your job. <laughs> <laughs> you, should be, you should be a banker. I like the one where you should be a cheerleader. Like, that's an actual job. <laughs> you should be a cheerleader. You should be my wife. Call me. <laughs> <laughs> if only people that smooth in real life, they're not. Yeah, that, that is an actual very fun. Imagine if you could just go around and select people's jobs, though. That'd be crazy, wouldn't it? It's just like, you could be a banker. You know what? I'd be really selfish with that. I wouldn't care about anyone else's job. I just kept that mine. <laughs> yeah, you probably would. <laughs> and uh, If that was me, they'd be like, uh, what job would you like? Oh, I think I'll be a pilot today. And I'll be a doctor. I'll be a doctor tomorrow. And a pilot. I love to know. <laughs> that accent, DJ. <laughs> I don't know where they come from. That that's where that that's where I do all my funny banter when I talk to um. Di- <laughs> oh, oi, 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 oi. yeah. Well, pirate like you don't really pirate. <laughs> oh, all about my ship, me hearties. <laughs> Walk the plank. <laughs> oh, dunk you underwater. <laughs> dunk you underwater. Well, that's what they used to do years ago, isn't it? 